Hey guys and welcome back to the channel and to episode 22 of Species Spotlight, where today's spotlight will be on the crystal jellyfish, a species which can be found on some shores around the UK in the summer months. So if you do go on to enjoy this video, please leave a like and remember to subscribe to make sure you don't miss a future video from me. But for now, let me tell you all about the crystal jellyfish. The crystal jellyfish is a hydrozone jellyfish that can grow to around 10 inches in diameter. They live in the deep ocean as well as offshore and is common in the North and Pacific Ocean but is rare in UK waters, mainly spotted washing up on beaches in abundance in the summertime. This graceful species can be identified by its nearly transparent body with distinct ridges that are known as radial canals. This species can also have long tentacles which can also be retracted like many of the individuals in these clips. Like many other jellyfish found in UK waters, the tentacles are packed full of specialised cells that eject venom that are used to paralyse prey. While this venom isn't powerful enough to paralyse or hurt humans, it can still cause a mild rash and itchiness to the skin, so it's best to avoid coming into contact with them. Crystal jellyfish are normally found along the west coast of North America, from central California to Vancouver, but due to ocean currents, they can be picked up and spotted off some UK coasts. This species is known to be cannibalistic and can expand its mouth when feeding to swallow jellyfish more than half its size, but it typically feeds on tiny marine organisms such as copepods. A characteristic that this species is known for is its bioluminescence. When it feels threatened or in danger, it activates a green fluorescent protein from more than 100 small organs in its body to scare away its predators. The protein these jellyfish produce is often used in biochemical experiments to detect calcium. So that's all you need to know about the crystal jellyfish. I do hope you all learned something new by watching this video and if you did please leave a like and remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.